Hello friends, welcome back to my channel if you're returning and if this is the first video of mine that you're catching, welcome. My name is Rachel and I'm a reseller on sites like eBay, Poshmark, and Mercari. I source primarily online through different liquidation companies. I get a lot of customer returns and anytime I get a new box, I come on this channel, I unbox it live and then I update you 90 days later based on my actual results. Today I'm opening the Everlane Accessories box from Helps You Source. So if you want to see what came in this box, definitely stick around. So this box has been listed on Helps You Source's website for a long time, quite a while. And I hesitated to buy it, and I'm sure maybe you did too, because it's expensive. I did decide to give it a try now. Um, couple of reasons. Number one, because we are coming into Q4, back to school, winter, and so it does depend on what kind of accessories are in here. If there are bags, cashmere scarves, leather belts, things like that, it could justify the cost of this very easily um, as opposed to gloves and socks. So I thought if I'm going to try it though, now is the time coming into Q4 when people are going to be shopping for this sort of thing. Um, so on the site, it was $480 for 40 pieces. Um, I have a 10% off code with Help Source, and last time I checked, this was still available. So they let me use my own code. If you want to use my code, it's oh yeah, you can take 10% off of anything you buy on the site, or it is linked down below. Check it out. I took 10% off or $48 off, but I had to pay $21.40 for shipping, bringing my total cost $453.40 for the box or $11.34 per piece. So that's hefty. That's really hefty. But again, if there's cashmere scarves and leather belts, it might not be so bad. Here's the box. It's moderately heavy for accessories. If you like reseller content, make sure you subscribe to the channel. I, like I said, anytime I do an unboxing, I come back 90 days later and I do a 90 day update. So if you want to see the update on this one, make sure you're subscribed. Hit that like button if you could. That lets me know you like this kind of content. And most importantly, let me know down in the comments, have you ordered this? Anybody else ordered this? Please let me know how yours did. I just want y'all to know I use a rating system. I rate the ease of listing, the quality of items, and the profitability in 90 days. I will, if it's great, initially I'll give it an oh yeah. If it's just okay or if I'm really not sure, I'm going to give it an oh okay. And if it's like I can already tell this is not going to go well, I'll give it an oh no. In the 90 day update, it is possible that it rates as a holy grail, which is better than oh yeah. That's just like best box ever. I made so much money. I am really need to get my hands on more of this. Or dumpster fire as in like this was really bad. Like this was a very terrible investment and uh, it doesn't get any worse. So let's open it up. I'll rate this at the end after I open it and I'll rate it again on the 90 day update. So I'm gonna get this stuff listed in a hurry. I do use List Perfectly to cross post. So um, I, I put it everything on at least Poshmark, eBay, Mercari, gives it the best chance of sale. And uh, the goal from there is to just move it as fast as I can. So let's see what is inside here. Now I do see, uh, it's not that heavy, I can show you. I do see there are quite a few belts in here. So that's, you know, that, that might be good. If they're leather and they retail pretty high, then, uh, you know, that might be a good thing for me. Uh, well, you know, we'll just start here. These are gloves. And again, we're at $11 per piece. Some are going to be good, worth much more. Some may not. That's kind of how this works out. Uh, yeah, these are just white, uh, white and gray gloves. Uh, size large. I'm not going to take them out of the package if they're new. Yeah, there's a lot of belts in here. This might be kind of hard to show you. Actually. So this is a belt. 
it's black. It does say on the back, genuine leather, made in USA, size small. So I'll have to see how much their belts retail for. And, you know, I may not pull them all out, but I bet you these are all going to be kind of the same. So this one is made in USA. This one's a medium, exact same belt. There's another small. And, you know, I, I've said it before. I'll say it again. You know, if, if, if they're going to sell, I totally don't mind the duplicates. It makes it way easier for me to list. So that's not, not an issue at all. This one is a size small. Same belt. There is more than just belts in here. There's just all these belts on top. So let me get through these first. Uh, this one's a small, again, these are all the same exact belt, same color um, so far. Okay, this one is, this one's brown. This is the same exact belt, but it's just, it's brown instead of black. This one's a size large. This one's like a, a dark brown. This one's a lighter brown. Also a size small. So it's the same belt again. Yeah, this, that'll make it really easy to list. But they're all the same. This one's dark brown. Size medium. Another dark brown. Size medium. Here's another dark brown. This one's a large. I swear there's more than just belts in here. Hang in there with me. This one's black, size medium. And these all look to be brand new. Now these might be customer returns. I guess they could be, but I mean, they look new to me. The only thing that's, you know, I guess a factor is going to be like if they're on clearance or something like if Everlane couldn't sell them, which usually is not the case, but this one's a size medium in black. Uh, this one's all taped. There we go. Size small. Size large. This is a black size large I promise I see the end of the belts I'm just trying to get through them all size medium and I think okay these are the last two at least that I can see Medium in black and medium in brown. Okay, let's see what actually else is in this box. So I'll tell you right now, I see more gloves. Um, large, large. I think that means large. And these are unisex. Uh, large. So I've got some of these gloves. I don't actually know if these are wool. Let me open one of them up. I'm, I'm interested to know the fabric content.
yeah so these these are a hundred percent wool these gloves so for the record um i don't know how much they actually sell for i'll have to research but here's a hat uh, the brushed cotton twill five panel cap burnt sugar. Scarf. This is 96% wool. Scarf. So I don't see a tag on it, but I mean, I think it is new. Again, these, these type of things might actually be worth $11 a piece. Here's a hat. Recycled cashmere. No tag on this one. Oh, I have two scarves here. They're probably the same if I had to guess. This one is recycled cashmere again. This one is too, they're the exact same scarf. Actually, I think here's another one. This one does have a tag, it's called the cashmere scarf. Here's another hat. This one has, this one has scarf fuzzies all over it, which I mean, okay. No tag on this one either. Here's another hat. This one's also 92% recycled cashmere. This one has the tag on it, the cashmere beanie. This one is 55% alpaca nylon or merino wool blend. This one's real lightweight. The cashmere bandana. Oh, okay. Didn't know you needed a cashmere bandana. Uh, this is the recycled cashmere bright navy. Okay, so I mean, here's this one has a price on it, seventy five dollars retail. So okay, I don't. I mean, I I don't know how much it'll resell for, but that's that's expensive for a hat. This one is 97% wool, beanie hat. I think, is this the same one? Yeah. The felted merino beanie, heathered oat. Yeah, these are the same. One has a tag, one does not. There's another scarf. This one's kind of a bummer because the Everlane tag is, is pulled off. So I don't even, like it's at this point unbranded. So I don't know if I can list that one. I don't know if I would list that one. Here's another hat. The brushed cotton twill five panel cap. Burnt sugar. These hats don't retail for very high, but I did order um, a, a box that got some hats in it before and they sold fast. So this is a nylon cap. I think I saw another one of these. Oh, we're at the end almost. Okay, this is not nylon. This one is the baseball cap. Okay. Couple more here. The recycled cashmere scarf again. So I already had a couple of these. And I think this is another bandana. Yeah, another one of the cashmere bandanas. So that's everything. I'm just gonna count and make sure I got 40 pieces here. Okay, here's all the belts. There's 17 belts and 24 of everything else. So what is that? Math is hard, y'all. That's 41 pieces. So I got an extra piece, but I also got an unbranded scarf I can't list, so I guess we can call that even. All right, so. Quality of items, I'm going to give it an oh yeah. I only saw one 
maybe two that I wouldn't list, um, but I did get 41 pieces. So quality of items, oh yeah, that that is absolutely an oh yeah. If we're just looking at quality, I'm actually pretty impressed here. Ease of listing, again, this is going to get an oh yeah too. I um, There's a lot of duplicates, but not in a bad way. I'm, I'm thinking it's going to be in a good way. I mean, I'm hoping these belts and stuff are worth a decent amount, but it should be very, very easy for me to look them up. And then it's not going to take me a ton of work because there is a, a bit of duplicates in here, but not necessarily in a bad way. And then profitability in 90 days, um, just because I don't know, and because the cost of goods is so high, I'm going to give it an oh, okay. That one, I think time is just going to tell. We're just going to have to let time tell us the story on that one. So I am going to get to work listing. Let me know what you think down in the comments. If you've bought this before, I really would like to know if you had a similar assortment. And if you want to grab one of these boxes, check out the link for Helpsy Source down below. 10% uh, off with Oh Yeah, not only on this box, but it works on all the boxes on the site. And um, make sure you subscribe if you want to see that 90 day update. I will come back 90 days later after I've had a chance to sell everything. It's August now, so it'll be December, like right after the Black Friday rush that I get a chance to update you on this and the timing should be pretty good. So I will, uh, I'll get back to you on that one. And uh, otherwise, that is it for today, friends. Thank you so much for watching and I will catch you in the next one.